In this video, we will look at a GZ curve for an angle of lol. This is what a GZ curve for an angle of lol looks like. Let's now study the GZ curve in more detail. Initially, the vessel has a negative GM, as the first part of the curve in red is below the horizontal axis and forms a capsizing lever as shown in the diagram outlined in red. As the vessel is healed, it will settle to an angle of lull. This is where the GZ curve crosses the horizontal axis. The diagram in the red box shows there is no writing lever. If the vessel is healed further, it will form a small writing lever and the GZ curve in the red is above the horizontal axis and is therefore positive. The vessel will only return to the angle of lull. Note the area under the GZ curve is a lot less than normal as the curve is flattened and consequently the vessel has lost a lot of dynamic stability. Thank you for watching the video. For more information about Master 200 and Master 500 examination preparation courses visit www.master200.info or call Andy on 087 707 9989.